Hello everyone, how are you doing? I'm very pleased to say that I've had a tidy up in my workshop. Look, look, look at all my jars. Have you seen that idea before? You, you what you do is you, you put your cap there and then you put your jar there. You probably know it. You're a bunch of old old folks old fogies yeah i didn't say old farts oh i've already mended a chair today look i found all these old coins old um pennies and fruitnesses and shillings and i'm going to make a guardian bell i saw someone making one on YouTube and um, I thought I could do that although the guy who was making it he had all the proper tools and that presses and whatever you I haven't I've just got I don't know if this will work but I've got this washer I'm gonna try and press this penny through it to get the dome of that one and then I found this outside. I don't even know what it is. I'm going to take that bit out. Or oh, maybe not. And then I could... Anyway, I'm going to press... I'm going to press pennies through it. I'll need two pennies to do this project. And uh, I don't know if it will work. But my last attempt was a complete disaster. I had no idea what I was doing. Uh... But this time I've got a rough idea what's necessary. I've got some, I've got solder. I've got some flux. Uh, and I've got some funny shaped hammers, which might help me as well as a dome, the dome of it. These, um, these hammers, ball peen ball pain hammers I'm thinking thinking that bending that over like that somehow or oh I said I've just this is an idea put the penny on there like that turn that hammer up like that and then bash the top of that hammer yeah anyway I'll get on with this I mean it might not work but if it does work I'll show you the finished result so at the moment I could just be talking to myself I just had I just had a, um, another idea instead of, instead of doing that and bashing this hammer I'm going to try and put this in the vise with a stay there a minute can you see the vice yeah so I'll put that I'll come around this way I'll put that there and that there wind it up a bit see if that's see if it if I've got enough strength to do that I'll do that hold that there oh no I'll do it that way bear with mate bear with that there like that and then do it. oh I know what I should have done I should have heated that coin up annealed it I think it's called but I haven't done that so I'm just going and it's already bending whether I have enough strength to I might need to go I might need to get a longer 
Bah. Äh. Aber ich kann ihn nehmen. Ich kann ihn nicht. Ah. Ich kann ihn nehmen. Uh, I'll be back in a minute. I'm going to try and find something to put on the end of this. Found, found this heads a little bit like that. See if I get a bit more strength into it. Yeah. You can buy all these sort of things to make little bells and rings and stuff. Oh, something snapped. I think it may have just gone a bit crooked. Let's see how that looks. You can see it in the bottom there, look. A little bit crooked. I'll try and get that out. Sorry, there it is. Excuse my fingernails. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think it needs a little bit more. So uh, I'll carry on, but I'm very pleased with that. I, I didn't expect that to happen, actually. Didn't expect it to be that good. I mean, you know, it might still go pear-shaped, but it's good fun. I'm gonna give it a bit more of a push. I'll put, I'm using this thing, I, just, this, I don't know what it is. I just found it outside lying on, <laughs> lying on the ground, as you do. I'm always finding stuff around here. So I'm going to give that a bit welly with my extra bit of pipe. I'll try and hold this and do the pipe as well. Something's happening. I've forgotten how to do the rest of it but I'm not going to look it up I'm just going to actually I just had an idea how I can do it it come to me suddenly as the actress said to the bishop I don't really need to be puffing and panting like this just for effect And put this third camera down a minute. Sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry about the camera work. Give it a bit more welly like that. It's definitely going in, as the actress said to the bishop. <laughs> I wish I'd stop saying that. <sighs> I wonder, I hope it won't split the coin. Will it split that copper? I think that's why you heat it up so that it softens the uh, copper. Actually, that would have made it a lot easier, I think, if the copper was soft or softer. It's pretty soft anyway. It's the Queen's head I'm bashing in here. But it, as it's. Uh, an out of date coin. I don't expect it will matter. I miss the Queen actually. I mean, I'm not. I wasn't a great royalist, but I liked having her about. I'm not. I'm not too keen on Charlie. I think he's a bit of a woke. Look at that. Unfortunately, it's not. It's a little bit wrong and I wasn't actually centered but you know it's my first go so uh, I 
actually I've lost the lost the pattern that the Queen's head was there but it's gone you can put some uh, T TP TP tape on it and that stops you losing losing the uh, detail I've got some somewhere I'll do I'll do that I'll just keep on with this one for now so I think I've got to make that so that means I've got to use a narrower a, a narrower ball pane like that and that should push that in further and hopefully I'll be able to get it out again as the bishop said to the actress <laughs> shut up John you fucking idiot oops not swearing this channel get that there up a bit Is that level Let's see how I go on. I hope you can see I hope the camera's picking this up something's happening but I'm worried now about splitting the coin but as it's a first attempt it won't really matter <sighs> I haven't got a guardian bell on my uh, I've got one on the sportster but I haven't got one on the on the road king I'm not making this for myself because you can't give yourself a guardian belt you have to be given one hint hint but uh, I'll probably give this to one of you huh? well I mean if it works right see how that looks I really wish I'd annealed it now I think that's what you call heating it annealing it but I didn't so tough and that's what I've got now and then you get another coin you've got another coin this is a George 1945 I'll keep that one that's when the war ended I'll put another Queen one 1963 that's when I joined the Merchant Navy. I'll keep that one. Uh, 1945. Ah, yeah, what we've got here. 1967. Ah, I was 20 years old. I'll keep that one. No, I'm only joking. Right, so now I've got to make a hole in this somehow. so that I can and then when I and it gets pressed it becomes a a tube thing and then you join the two together but I'll have to figure out how I'm going to make that hole so I'll be back I'll be back I'll be honest with you I was thinking because I'd seen it done of uh, cutting center out of that punching it out but um i wanted to keep the punched out bit to make the the dinger inside the bell little bell which is what that what i saw on youtube but i i can't i can't think of a way of doing it satisfactorily so i'm going to i'm going to drill it i'm going to drill out the middle with a big drill and then uh, I've got some other bits. I've got some other bits. Oh, here, look, I can uh, use this. To do. And I've also got all these, all these little things for grinding metal and what have you. So I've got bits and pieces that I can do it with. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to drill through there 
so then that's my hole and then I have to press it through again press it through and it will hopefully become like a bit of pipe you know what I mean oh didn't know you were still going um, the big drill didn't work not sharp enough so I'm having to use a smaller drill but it's all a learning curve isn't it oh, I better stop that I better put this down because otherwise it's all going to go pear shaped it went went off center a bit and then I went to take it out, <laughs> but my finger bloody hot. So, anyway, well that's why am I doing it without? I get a get. I'll get some pinches. And out of there, drop of water over here. Right, let's see. Uh, I can file that now and make it a better. I can centralize it with a file. I'll go to the bottom of that. Oops. Oh, I didn't really want that to happen. But as you know, it's a prototype, isn't it? Just tuck this under my arm. Don't worry all the puffing and panting, it's, I'm just doing it for effect. <sighs> right. Oh, it's not that bad. Oh, I didn't do too badly. Um, I could just do it a little bit more. I just need to come that way a bit. Yeah, I'll, I'll do it a bit more. When I ordered this set, I didn't realise they were miniatures. I thought I was ordering a, a set of bigger, you know, bigger things. Uh, it's another one of the, I think I got it on Facebook. I just don't ever learn my lesson. Don't buy stuff off Facebook adverts. It's usually crap. Anyway, so I'm going to use one of these now to finish that off. So this is where I am now, I've made that hole, not terribly central but as I say this is just the first one, this is the beginning of a new enterprise, Guardian Bell manufacturer to the stars. So I'm going to put that there, then I'm going to press through, oh where's that one gone, oh that, uh, that one, oh that might be a that might be a bit. Anyway, I'm going to press through. I can look in my shipwrights box that my son got me. And I'm sure I can find some more ball pain hammers somewhere in there if I need to. But for now, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to press through, except that this time there's a hole in it and hopefully it will become a tube. Just drop the bloody thing. It's gone down. Down the back. Oh.
Oh dear. Too many bloody gaps in this place for it to go to. Let's see if I can get to it. If I can see it. Uh, let's move this ammo box out of the way. Get under there. Stop messing about. Where are you? I can't see it. Uh, I, I can feel it. That's it. Uh, don't worry about the puffing and panning. I'm just doing it for effect. Right, I'll try again. It goes on there. What if I slap this in my pocket like that? Would it stay there? So I can demonstrate. Oh, we're actually recording, are we? I recorded all that. Oh, talking to myself. All right, so. Guys, let's see if I can do it without dropping it again. Please don't, please don't go. We're in. There. Now, I've got to do the same thing and hopefully that, that will become a tube this time. Actually, hopefully, very hopefully. Not at all hopeful on this one. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see just about. Right, let's go. This is where it's likely to split, wouldn't you think? Because I've already made that hole in it. Next time I will remember to anneal. This is going to fall off. That's ah, gone all crooked. Ah! No, you've got to come up. Bear with, it's just a prototype. I don't know why I keep saying bear with either. I learned it off some bloody television program years ago. Some stupid woman was saying it. Not saying that women, all women are stupid, but this one, she was, she was a comedian woman. Well, we're, we're definitely pressing. I want it to be a tube, not a bell this time. Not a, not a dome, rather. Don't worry about the puffing. It's just effect. For effect. It's nice having a tidy workshop. I'll get in here and get projects done. Right, I think is that enough? Please don't split. Right, I'm gonna take that out now and See if I can find a smaller, a smaller ball pain hammer to go through the, the next stage. Ah, look, can you see? See, I can't see either. Oh, sorry about this. There, it's becoming a tube. I think I've got to use a smaller hammer now. Keep going. Sorry about this. Sorry about the camera work. Should have had a little tripod. I did have a little tripod, but it, it failed. Uh, right, so that was that hammer. Now I'll use this one to try and push through. Oh, that will push through. This might even be too small, this one. going to try something just going to see what happens I might keep using that one actually is that because that is just going to go right through 
yeah I'll keep using this one I'll turn you off a minute I don't want to bore you but I'm doing I'm going to do exactly the same thing as I've just done I decided I would heat it in the end just in case I was worried about it splitting this uh, gun's not very powerful just on the color gas camping gas thing but you know get it hot and uh, should do the trick God, I wonder if this is going to work I don't know, I think that might be that might be hot enough lovely green flame coming off of the copper see it isn't that beautiful? It's an Elmo's fire. <laughs> Make me own. That is gorgeous, that colour. That'll do. Get in there. I'm trying to do stuff one handed. I need a film director. Turn this off for now. Right, let me get that. I ain't going to pick it up. I've got got me water over here. I don't know why it's over here. There. Now then, that should prevent it when I start the pressing through and what's got to happen is that this this bit has got to fit onto there so that that hole's got to be the same diameter as that that's what i'm trying to achieve look i found a ball bearing i'm going to experiment now doing that i'm going to put the ball this is how far i've got so far stretching it it's still um, not wide enough for the shape of that. I mean, it's almost there, but I'm going to just try and uh, put this ball bearing through put it like that. Put this in the vise like that, and then tighten the vise up. Oh, I don't know if you saw that, but anyway, look, it didn't go right through, and uh, I don't know, sometimes I think I'm turning the camera on, and I'm actually turning it off. But we're getting somewhere now. I'm going to turn the camera off. Sorry, I said to Jane... George we'll make good content. Oh, right. <laughs> George would dis go up and dismantle it for her, but of course he never did. So she paid her fellow to dismantle it. And she's waiting for me to take it away now because she wants to start. I can't do it. We can't do it Saturday because tomorrow we're doing that rope swing back at George's oh, right. work. Okay, Sunday. Could I tell her Sunday? Well, you know me. I go to church on Sundays, love. Well, she does. Sunday afternoon. Yeah, all right. Thanks. It's just got to be collected. Well, collected and we can use it. Right. We don't really need it. We have well, only got three hens. I know, but didn't and we've you got say four, that four we're going to get more hens, not rescue ones? No, we don't need more hens. They like to be on the water. No, but I mean to get, when, to get eggs. Um, yeah, we will get some more hens when I've made a proper run. I'm not going to have free range again because no, the fox just gets nice, them. This is a nice structure for them. All right, love, yeah, I'll do that. You paid sixty pounds to um, have it dismantled. So. Sixty pounds. Yeah, and I've offered to pay that, but she said no. But she does want it taken away. All right, love, yeah. Sunday afternoon, I'll tell her. Thanks. Okay, I Can must get on. Can you fit it in the van? Yeah, probably. So, excuse, sorry about that. That was Trisha talking about hen poops. 
Right, so what I've done, I've managed to get these both roughly the same size diameter. So I'm just giving them a sand down so they're nice and smooth. And uh, then I've got to join them together. Well, I might have to do a little bit more filing and as you can see, that's a bit misshapen. But, uh, I've just got to solder them, these basically solder them together now. So, uh, oh, and make a little hole in the top of that for the, I'll make it out a bit of wire, you know, to, to fix it onto the bike and to fix the, uh, the little ding a bit. What's it, what's it called? The little thing that goes ding, ding, ding inside. Fix that onto it. And then, uh, so I'm going to do that and I'll show you as I go. I nearly forgot, I'm just about to solder these two bits together. And, uh, I've got to... I'll try and put that there, like, I hope you can see. I've got to light this again. I started and then I thought, oh no, I'm supposed to be filming this. Oh. I hope that, I don't know if it's going to work. I fluxed it and I put that that coil of uh, solder or solder, as you say in America. We call it solder over here. We invented the English language. So we can. I don't know if it's going to melt or not. Please melt. Oh, it is melting. This is not going to be very good. This is, you know, it's my first go. sure if it's the right solder solder I think I've done it wrong anyway I think I've just burnt the bloody solder off <laughs> oh well right Oh, it's slightly soldered one side, but it's not soldered this side. Can you see that? Can you see the little bell that I've created? <laughs> it's a bit battered, but it's um, it would get battered, wouldn't it, on the bike, probably. I've got to make a hole in there now. Get a bit of wire through to hang it on the bike and also a little dingly thing that don't really need it but in for a penny in for a pound just um getting a bit of this wire and just dismantling it get to get a bit of copper out of here that will go through i'll make a little hole in there go through be a little clanger on it and there it is, my guardian bell made from two pennies. I'm very pleased with it. If you want it, send me your address. You can have it, first one, first one in response. It's not very good, but it's solid and robust. And I've blessed it. I'm really chuffed. <laughs> yeah, my soldering did work actually. Went all the way around. Thanks for uh, joining me today. I'll see you again soon. Bye. Bye.